One of the fundamental concepts within Christianity is the idea of sin, right? Mm -hmm. And that we are born, (laughs) you know, as babies, we're born evil. Like there's something innately wrong with us as human beings that we've already been born into sin. Mm -hmm. So it's like the, the, the starting point is already so different from Hinduism because it's telling us from the get go that something is wrong with our nature and it creates so much incompletion and suffering in us. And I, I've experienced personally that how much that affects your beliefs about yourself and life as you go through life. You know, there's so much guilt associated with that, so much unnecessary self-hatred, you know, and fear that does lurk in your inner space when you're constantly hearing these concepts affirmed and spoken about. And that, you know, if you don't repent and, and, you know, the concept, concept of hell and the devil and um, all of these things are very much based in we should choose the right thing be, out of fear of punishment mm-hmm. versus understanding the, the dharma in, every, in why we would want to do the right thing or our duty because we understand the context that, you know, what, what we put out comes back to us and right all of these type of you know, cosmic spiritual principles, instead of this idea that we have to be doing something or else, you know, I think that that in itself is one. And a lot of the, the foundation of that too, right, is, is also that concept that we are told all the time, we are sinners, and we, we never reach any type of state of enlightenment or state of God consciousness that you might have seen described in Eastern traditions. So again, there is that really strong separation between the divine and who I am. And it's emphasized really strongly and it creates, you know, a totally different identity about who we are, right? In in this world and why we're here versus within Hinduism. Mm-hmm.